analyst and founder of ProfitTaker.com. You look at a lot of mathematical equations uh, comparing the different markets. And what does it tell you about how we're going to do at the end of the day today? On the NASDAQ, uh, we still see that market as going down. Uh, our, our research does not indicate that we're at a bottom at this point. But you're only looking one to four days ahead. That's so right. So you can't tell us that, you know, five days from now would be a bottom for the NASDAQ. That's right. This evening we'll be updating our research and we'll be able to predict out again for four more days. And your prediction for today on the Dow was for a mixed day. The Dow was right? a mixed day, yes. We had we, we make several different predictions, and they were a little bit uh, in conflict with one another, so it wasn't a clear indication that the Dow would be down. But the NASDAQ was clearly indicated to be down today. Yes. And that's, in fact, what's happening. Yes. We're now higher for the Dow, um, and there are a lot of buy orders on the close, which would indicate a strong close for, for this market, at right. least. Neil, do you have a question? Yeah, when in the formulas that you use, you say you look at a variety of different markets. Right. Do you look at international as well as domestic markets? Uh, yes, we do. We look at uh, other stock indexes elsewhere, outside of the United States. Of course, we look at the, uh, the Treasury bond market, foreign currencies, uh, the various uh, domestic stock indexes as well. And we use a technology called Neural Networks that does pattern recognition to find the relationships between those markets so that we can make our forecasts. One of the things that I noticed is that gold is up today as the dollar is weakening. I assume that that's also because of the tensions with China. Probably so, yes. Now, will that change all of your forecasts? I mean, an event like this kind of changes everything? Well, we, we're doing it strictly by the numbers. So uh, as our software will run its calculations this evening, it will make its forecast for tomorrow and for the next four days. Uh, anything that might go on politically will be reflected in the price activity that's that's happening today. As of what you've seen so far, what's it look like for tomorrow? I think the NASDAQ has not made a bottom at this point, uh, at least based on our research, that's, that's clear. Uh, personally, uh, I don't think a bottom is made until you hear people say cash is king. And we haven't heard and that And we yet. haven't heard those three words. Lou Mendelson, we'll listen for those three words. Mm -hmm. He's a technical analyst with uh, ProfitTaker.com. Thanks.